All right, let's do a quick commentary on this duck under back take rear naked choke little shenanigans that I've been on lately. <laughs> you guys love this, so I'm going to break it down. So the first concept I want you guys to understand is the concept of someone pulling you in or you essentially using the person's body as a swing. So for example, this is going to be the entire concept that I'm doing. As you can see, pay attention. He grabs the back of my neck and instead of fighting and resisting, I just go with it, which makes me appear to be faster than a lot of people perceive me to be. So keep that concept in mind. So understand everyone in grappling has a dominant side that they like to grab the back of your head with. That is called a collar tie. When you can establish which side it is, and trust me, you will feel it, you need to go opposite collar tie against their strong collar tie, which is what you see me doing here. Now that we have this established, I need you guys to understand the direction that you're going. I have a left-hand collar tie. That means I'm going to be swinging towards the right. So the moment that I feel his dominated hand that he's comfortable with having the back of my head leaves the back of my head, I know it's coming back. That is the time you want to change levels and use your free hand to grab their lead leg. That lead leg grab is so important because that is what's going to make you turn the corner. And then after that, you just simply chase their back. And yeah, if you're fast enough, you can just swing into the back and choke them out while you're falling down, which is what I do here. So I tried to bait my opponent to reach for my head, but he wasn't doing it. So I figured that wasn't his comfortable side. So I switched sides. So now you see I have a right hand collar tie. Once I grab that, I get the inside position with my left hand. And you're going to see that he's going to begin pommeling inside. I'm watching his hand the entire time. And the moment he reaches is when I simply begin to change my levels. You're going to see my free hand grabs his lead leg, and that's going to allow me to turn the corner. Remember that collar tie is key because that's also what's going to help you swing. And if you do it fast enough, boom, you're going to fall straight into the choke and you'll be basically choking them. So here you guys go. I hope you guys kind of see the nuances of what happens. This is what it looks like when it is in super fast motion. <laughs> and you can get the choke. Boom, boom, boom. I think the takedown is really cool. And uh, yeah, I don't know what it's called. I do know that it's a duck under back take rear naked choke. But like, that's just submission wrestling as fine as and once you understand what exactly you're doing it looks fast i mean i am moving fast but they pull you into it the whole motion is literally you swinging into it so i hope that helps and yeah try it out